first start this video off by saying thank you to you, the collective, who has been working with me and sharing my videos and liking and commenting and donating and subscribing. I just want to send that thank you to you because I know you don't hear it a lot. So thank you and you're doing a wonderful job. Okay, so now to the message. They see that you are able to see them. So whoever it is, whatever it is, they see that you can see right through everything. They know you to be one of the top spy whistleblowing light workers of all time, who is able to engage in every astral dimension, if needed, go into the lowest of the low to gather information and then go into the highest of the high to gather information. I'm sorry, it's a hill, so and trying to exercise here um, and you're able to gather information and they see they see that in you they see the power that you hold they see that your ability is too it's too powerful for some of them they find you to be overly powerful and they they're irritated by that but what they don't know is that that you drew attention to them the negative ones who are like kind of like how dare she or he, she or he, do all this work and, and do all this good work and be a clairvoyant and see things and travel, astral travel and go to these dimensions and find out all this information and come here and save souls from, from, from us harvesting them because that's what they're doing. They're harvesting souls, right? And I told people that I had this dream. So just in case you're first time hearing this, I'll say it again because I will not stop repeating this message. They showed me a dream where millions of people were in a portal and Jesus, Jesus was in a portal. And he was like, go that way. Yes, my child, go that way. They're like, Jesus, Jesus, oh. And they all sat in the car and they thought like they're sitting in cars. Like that, that makes no sense. Why would Jesus have you go through a portal and sit in a car and travel everybody in one portal in one direction? going that way. So I got out of the car and I jumped down and I ran the opposite way. And I went to the end of the portal. And I said, you can't do this to people. You're lying to them. You're misleading them. You're lying to them. And he said, I can do whatever I want. They think I'm Jesus. And a guy standing next to him said to him, oh God, shut up. She's going to go down there and tell everyone. And exactly what you said, I did. I woke up and told everyone. And when I did, for like a week straight, I was attacked by spiritual entities. I was attacked by dark, dark, by dark energies. And I was attached, attacked by them. And they don't want me to tell you this. That's why they're trying to slip my words up and make me confuse myself. But I will never lose the message. And ever since then, my guys have come together. And they brought a band of energies together to help protect me. And that's what they're doing with you right now. You can see, I'm, I'm hearing, you can see, you can smell the difference. You can feel the difference. How we have come in. To clear the darkness that was attacking you we have come in and we have done a lot of clearing for you with you with you not just for you with you because you've been doing the work too only you know those who have been doing the work you know who i'm talking to so they want you to know that you are seen as a highly powerful like i'm seeing like cracks on the floor and you come in and you fill all these cracks up like you come in and you fill all those cracks up that you see on the floor you go in and you just fill it all and all of a sudden there's no more bumps on the road and nobody's car gets messed up because of you. That's what your ability is. You have the power and the ability to shine so bright your light that when you get to these destinations, they're afraid when you enter those realms. They're terrified of you. Oh, no, no, no. She's here. And you have gone. Who have you gone to the lower astrals, the higher astrals, the different planets? You have been... Not only the light worker, the healer, the empath, the Reiki master, the star seed, but you have been in all time, space, and dimensions. You have even pretended to be the darkness in order to find out information from the darkness. That's how incredibly talented you are. And now these people, they're here, they, they, you know, they're stuck in the same vibration. They keep talking about the same thing over and over again. They can't seem to get past this uh, message of, this and that and negativity and your ex this and your boyfriend that and they can't so they're just working keep working for the darkness keep se sending you the same message keeping you in the darkness you know trying to make themselves out to be these like powerful people when they're not they have nothing compared to you and they're they're going to compete with you and that's the funny part is you're not competing with them you just want to know 
Like, why people think that they can play with you? Because they can't. They can't play with you because what you're seen as in every dimension is a freaking powerful warrior. And you know, you've battled many lifetimes and now the war is over and you can rest, I'm hearing, child. You can what? You can rest. Those of you who've been going through what you've been going through, this is your guide telling you, watch for this next, uh, this next chapter. You know, I'm hearing if there's something you're experiencing or going through and you need help with it, please seek help with in any way possible that you need it because your guys want to help you maintain your, um, your light. Your light's not going nowhere, but they just want to help you maintain whatever light that you feel you're losing right now because of maybe anger or resentment or something like this. I see a foundation of your home changing, a fantastic new beginning, a phenomenal new way of doing things. I see family, happiness, light, and love and those people that are around you that are irritating you that are frustrating you it's not going to be like that no more they got you now okay so be patient hold steady maintain your light know that you are the light you are the love and that good things are coming your way and just remember how powerful you are and of course the powerful ones are always going to feel attacked because that's how it works okay so if you're seeing this just remember who you are in all time, space, and dimensions, past, present, and future. You are the light and you are powerful. And we love you. And you are a psychic son of a boo. So go on out there and be somebody. Use your gifts. Welcome to the Healers Club. And do what you need to do. Do what you came here to do. Go on your mission and be happy to do it. Don't be afraid because you got a team on millions of angels that got your back. Okay? I love you.